It seems Pan has saved Gabriel once more. His arrival most fortuitous. Gabriel now enters the outskirts of the vampire's territory. A cold winter has gripped this land for centuries, driving out the inhabitants to warmer climes. Those stubborn enough to stay have contended with the cold death that visits them each and every night, taking their loved ones away forever. The vampires thrive in the cold and terrorize the living who crave warmth and companionship. This night a warrior will come, a knight in shining armor with death at his side. He comes for you, creatures of the night. Hi there, welcome back to our Let's Play of Castlevania Lords of Shadows. I'm your host, Chelsea, and we're going to be taking on the cold. I always like the way that the snow falls on the screen, but that means that whatever I'm doing is weird. It makes sense in a first person game. The nice effect in a third person game. Down you go. Up. These guys aren't even threats. Oh no, I hate these things. without my relics and powers. <laughs> this is gonna be... So last time we did it, I've been, I actually still had them, which is the yeah, video about the good audio, but... It's not as fun now. It's, well... Is how am I supposed to open a door and this thing laughing at me? And is there two of them? Oh crap. Damn it. Danny goes. That's right, I don't have any powers. Like, why can't I power up here? Crap, I can't even heal myself. Man, this is annoying. Level design is great. <laughs> Though. Like, oh yeah, you know all, the, all those fights, you kind of had like the powers of like gods on your side. Well, this time you don't. Good luck. He's still laughing at me. What a dick.
There have been numerous signs of tuber carbs in this region. The creature is not known to be deadly malicious, merely a nuisance. Let's get more back to the Brotherhood. I advise my comrades to gather as much fairy blossom as I can. The that tuber carbs are fascinating. By anything to do with fairies, the blossom is a good tactic to strike the pesky creature while retrieving anything it may have stolen. I don't know where it is, so... It even lets you know, like, if you're close to it or not, which is really cool, but... Can I even go up there? <laughs> cold, cold, cold. Ah, <sighs> that voice. I see. Still there? No. Scolding hot. Dick. When he's talking about dark crystals, it's a very use in combat. I stumbled across an old man who, seeing bewildered and senile, get there, heard to be a keen intelligence in his eyes. He claimed he was a friend and asked if I found the relics he had left for us, but told him I didn't understand. He said that he would pray for me and suddenly scurried off into the night. What do you mean by relics? Oh, so probably a chubacabra or something. It looks like an old man, I can see that. Okay. Down with the wall. We're very close to Weigel here. I just... Beyond the vampire castle. One must seek shelter at night for possible attack. The weather is cold and sending messages to the Brotherhood is proving difficult. Last night I received a communication from the Weigel village for an assault on the vampire stronghold. God help me, but I am afraid of becoming one of those blood-sucking creatures. Huh. Now that castle doesn't look foreboding at all. Huh. That's the end of the level. Chris watching and we'll see you on the next one.